channel. I am Pam's doing it again for those who are new and welcome back to all of my returning subscribers. How is everyone doing today? As for me, the weather in my city has been up and down, up and down, but I'm not complaining because God woke me up to see a new day. So yeah, y'all, without further ado, let me show you guys what I got. I have a small little haul for you guys today. I have some things from Bath and Body Works, which my daughter-in-law bought for me. And I also have one item that I will be sending to one of my YouTube sisters and a few other things that I have for my bathroom. But I will be having a video coming up really, really soon um, on a living room refresh. No, I'm not going to get any new furniture because the furniture that I have is still fairly new. It's just going to be like a change of, you know, curtains and rugs and decor and stuff like that because spring is quickly arriving and I just want to have all of my stuff ready so then I can just change it out. Okay? So without further ado, real quick, a few things I picked up at my local variety store is these closet block moth shields. I absolutely love these down in my basement. I was trying to look for the lavender and the clean linen, but they ran out, so I got the rose scented kind. I really don't like floral scents, but these were going in the basement and I don't spend that much time in the basement, so these will be fine. My daughter and my granddaughter be down there exercising. I'll be down there exercising with them real soon once my treadmill get back. But uh, yeah, so those were just a dollar. Then I picked up some of this Love My Carpet, and this is in Cherry Blossom. This smells so, so good. And um, it was a dollar and something cent. Of course, this wasn't a Dollar Tree, so, you know, it was a dollar plus. Then I picked up two bottles of this 50% rubbing green alcohol. Now, what I use my green alcohol for is good sterilization for my body. I absolutely love this and I put this in my bath water. No, I don't put no bubble bath, nothing sweet in my bath. I like to use this when I want to deep clean my skin. Like we deep clean our face from debris and makeup, you have to deep clean your body. Okay, so these right here works very, very well. Good sterilization for your skin. And you will be surprised when you see all of that stuff comes off your skin. From all that lotion, perfume, body spray, and oils and stuff like that. Every now and then you have to deep clean your skin. I mean, I like to use my... um my shower gels and stuff like that but first i like to deep clean my skin with this okay and i also picked up the 99 percent alcohol now i don't use this on leather but i do use these on the rest of the posters around the house like uh your chairs your beds and when i go through the house and start deep cleaning i strip all the beds down wash the mattress and stuff off and then i put this in like a spray bottle and i spray it all on the mattresses and the box springs okay then i picked up my all-time favorite is the lavender scented um mothballs this box right here came open but i haven't used it yet and i know a lot of people don't like mothballs but these are not your old-fashioned mothballs these don't smell really really strong they smell like the thing that you put in your toilet bowl like the, the freshener that you hang on the side of your toilet bowl this is what they smell like and these are clear so they dissolve pretty fast yeah, so I got two boxes of those and lavender. Okay, over here I have this handcrafted solid bamboo spice rack. It expands. Um, the reason why I opened the box because the back part of the box looked like it was damaged, and I wanted to open it up to make sure nothing was broke inside. And this is what it looks like. And this side right here expands. You know, you can make it short or you can make it long depending on how many spices you use on it. Um, a lot of people that I know, they also have these, and some of them use it for spice, and some people use it just to put their perfume and stuff like that on it, or what have you. So, well, anyway, I have one downstairs already in my kitchen, and um, I know she likes like to clean and, you know, rearrange things and stuff like that in her kitchen, so I thought that she might like this, so I ordered her one. Now that I know that it's not damaged, I'm gonna go ahead and seal it back and send it off to her. Okay. Try to keep it in order. Okay, she got me lotion. This is eucalyptus and tea. 
Then she also got me the body wash and foam bath. Then she got me the Peaceful Tea Tree and Peppermint Body Lotion. And here is the body, the body wash and foam bath as well. And also over here, she got me the Sleep. And this is the Lavender and Vanilla Body Lotion. And this right here one is Black Caramel Foam Bath. So these got different, these are different, but nevertheless, they're gonna be used. <laughs> Juniper, Juniper and Coriander body lotion. And this right here is a body lotion. I guess right here, this one is in the two. So actually, I think the same thing. But look at the packaging, it's really, really pretty. Okay, now let's say open the box. And she got me three candles. Child, like I needed any more candles. But nevertheless, I am a Bath and Body Work candle lover. So let me see which one is this also has um the 20 percent all this is on your online order these are the new scent candles that they have out i guess yeah, so. okay, let me go get these right here out the boxes and um over here she got me a frosted cranberry this is my oldie but goodie can't go wrong with one of these frosted cranberry i don't care what the season is what the temperature is outside this smells good all year long. Thank you, thank you, thank you, daughter. Also, she got me the Mahogany Teakwood. Oh my God, I absolutely love this candle. I think I got quite a few of these. If I'm not mistaken, I need to check my little stash. <laughs> you got the Teakwood. And this ain't the high intensity one, this is the original one. So. Then she got me one of the new ones, and this is Strawberry Pound Cake. Y'all, look at this candle. It is the same color as the jar, and this smells wonderful. Let me read the keynotes on here. Okay, fresh strawberries, golden shortcake, whipped cream with essential oils. And this smells so good. Mm, it's not like I could just a bite out of it <laughs> okay then over here i picked up these two beautiful shower curtains see i had the because my shower pole is like rounded and yeah I've been wanting these shower curtains for quite a while. And every time I went to order curtains, they always were sold out. I had to order them pretty, pretty, pretty. Okay. One more thing and that'll be it. I don't know how in the world they stuffed this in this pack like this, but OMG. Okay. Hold on for a minute, y'all. <laughs> set for the floor. Okay, this is just the three piece. This is just the little hood part that goes on your toilet seat and it's in green. Okay, then I also got this little rug part that goes, got that, and this is uh, the long piece right here where you can put it on the outside of your tub. But I'm gonna put this right there by my sink because I have a memory foam floor mat coming back which you can step on when you get out the shower or the tub. So thank you. Okay, over here, another box from Walmart. I got this serving plate with a removable pedestal, but I don't want this pedestal to put a cake on. I'm going to use this. Actually, I got two of them and I'm gonna use one to put my plant on in the bathroom and i'm gonna use this one downstairs in my kitchen so stay tuned so i can show you guys what i do with I've this seen a lot of the cleaning motivational channel uh people with these right here not this particular one but i've seen them with quite a few of them this right here one only cost me eight dollars and 95 cents so this was a good idea to have in your kitchen instead of having everything around your sink and 
Uh, it was just a mess, so that's why I got this. See, I learned a lot from being on YouTube. Don't think the motivational girls be doing their thing. And half of the things that they get, I mean, they may spend money. But if I could get the knockoff, I will get the knockoff. Please don't come for me, y'all. But I know I got to get my kitchen together. I just wanted to show y'all a few things that you could stick on this pedestal, you know. Just a few things that I had got from Grove Collaborative. I might have got this little um, scrubby sponge that I didn't use yet. That's some Peony um, multi-surface spray. That's the dish liquid. And these are just some hand soaps and stuff like that. So yeah, just wanted to show y'all a few things that you could put on top of your pedestal. I mean, people put plants and all sorts of things. Knick-knack, candles, whatever you want. That's whatever you do with it. Cute Stay little tuned. scrubby hole that came from one of my YouTube systems. The actual caddy that everything came in. Minus the paint splash on the side. <laughs> and this is another um, little, um, this is a heirloom red, 100% organic cotton kitchen towel. And I have never opened. So here you go. Yeah. Stay tuned. I have a waist trimmer. My daughter got it for me. And she got herself one called Sweet Sweat Waist Trimmer. I heard a lot about these. And my daughter surprised me and got me this. I'm going to take it off the pack. It comes in a cute little carrying case, I guess, where you want to take it and you want to go, I guess, you know, you can wear it underneath your uh, clothes too. I mean, but I want to wear it underneath my clothes. I just work out in it. And it also comes with a pack of this Sweet Sweat Workout Enhancer. Uh, I think it's like a gel. It's a sample pack. Sweat harder. Target slow to respond problem area, making work out make any workout feel better. Prepare to be motivated. And so we got the directions and stuff like this on the cream before you put it on. So we're gonna take it off yes. first. She said this cost me twenty-seven dollars and some percent. And this is what it looks like. And this is in a large. They got different sizes. They got small, medium, large extra large and stuff like that she said so or just unfold it and this is what it looks like you know so. okay. wow yes and it's long it is long people okay. right there on the sweet sweat waist trimmer with a damp cloth before initial before initial use use a clean cloth to dry off and air dry overnight how to wear before exercising adjust your waist trimmer to the desired position and wrap it comfortably around your abdomen the sweats the sweet sweat waist trimmer is designed to be worn under your workout clothing how to wash using a wet cloth and soap wipe down the inner lining several times rinse off the soap with lukewarm water and use a clean cloth to dry off the waist trimmer or air dry overnight okay just reading a little bit of how you take care of it right, so much for watching my little haul here until the next video god bless be safe and stay prayed up bye bye